hello friends welcome back to the channel so today's video topic is how to remove or delete all the junk file from windows 11 to make it faster so without wasting your time let's start with our first step right click on your windows icon then click on run to open a run command or you can simply press window key and r to open your run command now type temp press enter so these are the temporary files in your system press ctrl a to select all the files and folder after that press shift key and delete key together to permanently delete these files click on yes take this option click on continue that's it escape these files now again open your run command now type percentage temp percentage then click on ok so these are also temporary files in your system press control key and a button together to select all the files then press shift key and delete key together to delete all the files skip this file cut this window again do the same thing open your run command now type prefetch click on ok to open the folder select all the files delete all the files click on yes now again right click on your windows icon then click on run now type recent click on ok now you will see these files so these all are the shortcuts you can see the type section so these are not the real file these are not the original files in your system these are only the shortcuts okay so delete all the shortcuts and don't worry it will not impact in your original files these are the temporary locks in your system select all the files then delete cut this window move on to a next step click on your windows icon click on the search box and type disk cleanup click on this option disk cleanup now tick all the options and these are the temporary files all the junk files in your system tick all the options then click on ok then click on delete so this option will delete all the temporary files in your system it will not impact your personal data it will only delete the temporary files the junk files in your system click on delete files now after that always make sure you have at least 10 to 15 GB of free space in your C drive uh, right now you can see I have 95.4 GB and it is more than enough but make sure you have at least 10 to 15 GB of free space in your C drive which contains your operating system files now run the preloaded antivirus in your Windows 11 operating system so click on this up arrow and you will see the antivirus uh, logo or icon here or you can click on this windows icon in the search box type antivirus and you will see this option virus and threat protection click on it so this is your preloaded antivirus by microsoft and it is very good always run your antivirus weekly basis so open this screen then click on this option scan options and there are three options available no there are four options available you can see quick full custom scan or you can run a offline scan as well microsoft defender antivirus offline scan so there are four options you can choose any of them i will show you how to uh, run the antivirus simply click on go for the full okay i'm going right now i'm choosing this quick scan then click on scan now so this will scan your system and remove if there is any kind of malware scanning process completed 
and there is a zero thread found in my system so always scan your uh, system in weekly basis now move on to our final step always update your operating system so right click on your windows icon then click on settings you will see this option settings on the left side click on windows update and you will see pending updates so the point is always use a updated operating system always update your windows so these are the some tricks you can apply this is all for the video thank you